For centuries, the Voynich Manuscript has remained one of the greatest unsolved mysteries in the world of historical cryptography. Handwritten and illustrated in the early 15th century, this enigmatic book contains pages filled with unknown symbols, strange drawings, and bizarre depictions of plants and astrological signs. Despite numerous attempts by cryptographers, linguists, and historians, its meaning has eluded understanding, until now. In a groundbreaking revelation, an advanced AI system has seemingly cracked the code behind the infamous Voynich manuscript, unlocking secrets hidden for over 600 years. This breakthrough discovery challenges everything we thought we knew about this legendary enigma and provides new insights into its possible origins and purpose. The mystery deepens. The Voynich Manuscript has long been regarded as one of the most perplexing artifacts to emerge from the late medieval period. Carbon dating places the vellum between 1404 and 1438, confirming its historical authenticity. Unlike other books of its time, the manuscript bears no author's name, no documented origin, and no references linking it to known works. It stands alone in libraries, defying every attempt to make sense of its contents. Over the past century, this perplexing volume has drawn attention from coders, linguists, mystics, and amateur puzzle solvers. Despite employing advanced cryptographic techniques such as frequency analysis, polyalphabetic ciphers, and pattern recognition, experts have continually hit a wall. Some believe it to be an encoded herbal encyclopedia, an alchemical manuscript, or even an elaborate hoax. Yet, the manuscript's repeating patterns suggest an underlying structure, one too complex to be random. The Physical Characteristics and Symbolic Illustrations The Voynich Manuscript consists of approximately 240 pages of vellum, a high-quality writing material made from animal skin, suggesting that it was created with considerable care and intention. The parchment remains in surprisingly good condition, with crisp drawings and vibrant inks that have stood the test of time. Many pages feature large, detailed illustrations of unknown plants, often surrounded by text. These plants, while vaguely recognizable, do not match any known botanical species. Some appear to be composite plants, combining elements of different species, making classification impossible. Other pages display star charts swirling circular diagrams, and astrological symbols such as fish for Pisces and a bull for Taurus. One of the manuscript's strangest sections features small nude human figures bathing in tube-like structures, possibly representing medical treatments, medieval rituals, or something more esoteric. Yet none of these images align with known medieval art styles, leaving scholars baffled. Early Attempts to Crack the Code Long before AI became a viable tool, scholars and codebreakers attempted to decipher the Voynich manuscript through traditional means. Early cryptographic techniques, similar to those used to break Elizabethan-era ciphers, were applied with no success. In the early 20th century, an American scholar suggested the manuscript was written by the 13th-century scientist Roger Bacon and contained advanced scientific knowledge centuries ahead of its time. However, no concrete evidence supported this claim. During and after World War II, military codebreakers attempted to decipher the text, but also failed. As computational technology advanced, mainframe computers were used in the late 20th century to analyze the text, Yet no conclusive results emerged. Each attempt only deepened the manuscript's status as an unsolvable puzzle. AI, the ultimate codebreaker? With the rise of artificial intelligence and machine learning, researchers saw a new opportunity to finally unlock the manuscript's secrets. AI excels at detecting patterns, statistical regularities, and linguistic structures that human minds may overlook. By digitizing the Voynich text and feeding it into natural language processing NLP models, researchers allowed AI to analyze letter frequencies, word groupings, and structural consistencies. The AI compared these patterns to vast databases of known languages, 
hoping to find a match that had eluded scholars for centuries. One of the first major breakthroughs came in 2016 when a team of computer scientists from the University of Alberta suggested that the manuscript might be a warped or scrambled form of Hebrew. The AI identified potential links between certain words in the manuscript and words in medieval Hebrew texts, hinting at the possibility that the text had been deliberately altered to conceal its meaning. What was found? Recent AI advancements have revealed that the Voynich Manuscripts script follows a linguistic pattern consistent with real, structured language, likely a form of encrypted medieval Hebrew or another lost dialect. The AI's findings suggest that the text may describe herbal remedies, medical treatments, or alchemical processes. While further validation is needed, this AI-driven discovery opens the door to decoding the entire manuscript potentially shedding light on lost knowledge from centuries past. Could the Voynich manuscript be a guide to forgotten medicine, an alchemist's secret code, or something even more mysterious? One thing is certain. History has never been closer to uncovering the truth behind this legendary enigma. Stay tuned as experts work to confirm these findings and finally unlock the manuscript's ultimate message. The Voynich Manuscript AI, Hebrew, and the Ongoing Mystery The Voynich Manuscript has long been one of history's most perplexing enigmas. Its strange script, elaborate botanical illustrations, and complete lack of a known translation have left scholars, cryptographers, and enthusiasts puzzled for centuries. In 2016, a bold claim reignited interest in the manuscript. Artificial intelligence had supposedly identified Hebrew as the underlying language. This tantalizing revelation sparked both excitement and skepticism, pushing the debate into new territory. The 2016 Hebrew Connection 2 researchers in 2016 announced that they had used an AI-based approach to analyze the Voynich manuscript and found Hebrew to be the best linguistic match. Their project utilized natural language processing, NLP techniques, scanning the text for character groupings, word structures, and frequency patterns. The AI software compared repeating segments, letter adjacency, and potential vowel consonant structures across multiple languages. After extensive computation, the results pointed to Hebrew as the likeliest candidate. This was a surprising conclusion, considering that Hebrew's script is visually distinct from the looping glyphs found in the Voynich manuscript. The researchers proposed that the manuscript might contain a disguised or anagrammed form of Hebrew, where the letters had been deliberately scrambled. This theory aligned with historical encryption methods that rearranged letters to obscure meaning. As partial evidence, they provided a tentative translation of the manuscript's first line, suggesting it could mean, she made recommendations to the priest. The claim generated significant media buzz with headlines proclaiming that AI had finally cracked the age-old mystery. However, deeper scrutiny of the project revealed serious limitations. Skepticism Surrounding the Hebrew hypothesis Linguists and medieval scholars raised several objections to the AI's findings. While the algorithm produced compelling statistical matches, it lacked a clear, systematic method to reconstruct the text into readable Hebrew. Moreover, anagramming an entire manuscript would have been an extraordinarily labor-intensive process for a medieval scribe without any known precedent in historical cryptography. Additionally, the glyphs of the Voynich manuscript do not closely resemble any form of Hebrew script from the Middle Ages or later periods. Hebrew is typically written with angular or squared shapes, whereas the Voynich script features fluid, looping characters. While it is conceivable that a new script could have been invented to encode Hebrew, the absence of supporting historical documents made this hypothesis difficult to validate. Another issue was the AI's reliance on letter frequency analysis, which could easily pick up coincidental overlaps rather than genuine linguistic relationships without proving that entire sections of the manuscript could be translated consistently. The Hebrew claim remained unconvincing. AI and competing decipherment methods.
The Hebrew hypothesis was not the only attempt to apply artificial intelligence to the Voynich manuscript. Multiple AI teams have used different machine learning models to analyze the text. Some relied on deep learning algorithms that detected glyph transitions, while others focused on linguistic structures and syntax patterns. Despite varied methodologies, all faced a fundamental problem. The manuscript lacks a known plaintext or a bilingual reference like the Rosetta Stone. Some AI-driven projects expanded beyond letter analysis, examining paragraph structures, recurring symbols, and unique markers such as star-shaped glyphs. Others speculated that the manuscript might use steganography, hiding information in spacing or letter arrangements rather than in the script itself. Despite these creative approaches, no AI model has been able to produce a full, verifiable translation. The manuscript's origin remains an open question, and AI's role, while promising, has not yielded definitive answers. The Hoax Hypothesis Another theory suggests that the Voynich manuscript is not a coded language at all, but an elaborate hoax. Some researchers argue that it could have been created to deceive collectors or patrons in the 15th century. One scholar, Gordon Rugg, demonstrated how a simple carden grill, a stencil-based writing method, could generate text that mimicked the Voynich script's patterns. If the manuscript is indeed meaningless, then AI's attempts to extract meaning might be a case of finding false patterns, much like seeing shapes in clouds. Supporters of the hoax theory point to the manuscript's consistent structure, which could have been carefully designed to appear meaningful without actually conveying real information. However, others argue that the text's complexity and systematic repetition suggest a genuine language or code rather than mere gibberish. Other Theories and the Future of Decipherment Even among those who believe the manuscript contains real information, theories vary widely. Some propose that it represents an extinct or highly obscure dialect, possibly a lost Proto-Romance language. Others suggest Middle Eastern influences, given the historical cross-cultural exchanges between Europe and the Islamic world. A few even speculate on non-European origins, pointing to Asia as a potential source. Another hypothesis interprets the manuscript as a medieval medical or botanical text, possibly related to women's health. The frequent depictions of bathing nudes alongside plants hint at herbal remedies or fertility treatments. However, if the book was meant for practical use, encoding it in such a cryptic manner seems counterproductive. The lack of similar documents or references to it in historical texts further complicates this theory. At the core of all these debates lies the same issue. The manuscript remains unreadable. AI systems attempting to link it to Hebrew, Latin, or other languages have yet to break through the barrier of full comprehension. Until a repeatable, verifiable translation method emerges, the Voynich manuscript will continue to fuel endless speculation and scholarly intrigue. Conclusion The AI-driven attempt to decipher the Voynich manuscript through Hebrew was an exciting development but ultimately failed to provide a complete solution. While artificial intelligence has advanced the discussion by identifying patterns, it has not cracked the manuscript's true meaning. Whether the text is an encrypted language, an elaborate hoax, or something else entirely, remains an open question. For now, the Voynich manuscript continues to defy explanation, keeping its place as one of history's greatest unsolved mysteries,